Hello, welcome back to a new episode. So I lowered a little bit the audio because I saw the previous one and the, the audio of the game was a little bit too high. So uh, yeah, let's continue. We are in uh, this council chamber. Let's finish up our quests and uh, get the new ones and uh, let's proceed forward. In the beginning, the game will uh, basically uh, teach you what to do. Okay, so we increase our idol capacity and we get to idols. So this one is uh, increase health and this one poison on hit. Let's put this one first. Okay. Uh, let me check the vendor. Maybe we can find something nice. Yes. First of all, let's uh, sell these. I don't think we need this one. Let's search after minion. So this one, minion physical damage. That's great, to be honest. Okay, we can move forward. Uh, on the next area. So as I said, the loading times are a mess in this game. We have a side quest here, so let's enter in this uh, Erza's uh, library. I hope the sound is uh, not too loud. We also got uh, some levels. We can increase our minion damage. Whenever you have additional, okay, you have additional poison resistance, and whenever you kill an enemy, you have a chance to inflict poison on enemies. Okay, that's not that great. Maybe we can go with this, or maybe with ward retention. This necrotic damage, that's also nice. Minion armor per level. Okay. Character level. Interesting. I think this uh, it's also good. Increase hell regen for me and my minions, but uh, it reduces the drain uh, from this. So that's a bummer. Okay, so we have another point. So let's put another point here. I think we can start with this one. We got another skill, Spirit Plague, but it's it's good. But as I said, we will play a, a minion build. We should increase our minion damage higher. Let me check a little bit the sound. Let's go this way. Okay, so the scale is uh, 
increase minion damage okay it's not uh, better than the one that we have let's see then we will go here and i think we will uh, basically remove the archers and uh, keep just the warriors Okay, so the next one is in the main town. Do we have a portal here? I don't think so, but I think we will come back into the town. So let's uh, proceed with our main uh, story. Come on, minions, where are you? And these boots are the same. Okay, so the golem apparently got stuck. Okay, so we got a glyph of despair. Okay, let me... Okay, so after this uh, we can put a point in a blood infusion. We are level 14. Let's increase this because it will keep our minions alive. Let me check a little bit our uh, minion health. That's nice. Okay, how much? Okay, so we almost uh, have... Uh, 200% more minion HP. That's really great. This seems to be a boss. Let's move forward from that lining. I think we can tip it back to town, finish the side quest and the main quest.
as I said that's the bummer thing is that the loading times are a bit much but not that uh, not that uh, I don't know game breaking let's say okay we finish this we finish okay so he gave us an amulet I think it always will give us gamblers follow CDs I think it's okay we don't need that many minion health at least for the moment let me check again what items do we have I think we can sell them. Yes. I'll keep this amulet, maybe we can craft it. Let's check. Minion. Nothing on the minion, but let's pick this uh, rune of shattering. Follow your feet. Let's increase our regeneration. let me check something this is also good it will give our minions attack speed but increase area the other ones doesn't matter that much this one it's okay it's a leech this one is good until this point after that maybe we can go different route Let's move. We are here. We should go here. Okay, there's a mage here. So oh, these are powerful enemies trapped. Let's try to do it because I think the minions can handle it. Okay, so he does a lot of damage. Okay, so he's down. Okay, so he gave us an e experimental affix. Okay. Let's move forward. So... Uh, the best part is that uh, when we'll get the necromancy mastery 
We will increase our damage a lot. Right now we are doing okay-ish. We don't have the highest clear speed, but... We have some. Okay, we got a uh, legendary. Okay, it's uh, it's okay for us, but it's uh, as I said, elemental damage. But uh, for the resistances, it's okay. Okay, so this is a boss. Idol of loading. Okay, we need to move to the second era or another era. I think it will co be called ancient uh, ancient era. So you you need to move through eras to get past different uh, obstacles in the world. Okay, so. I think this is the dinosaur era. the other side of the cavern we should be on the other side yeah I think this is uh, the area with the side quest. I might be wrong. No, we are right. Okay, this uh, minion damage is way better way equipped than this critical strike one because the crit the um, you need to have minion 
specified on the affix or suffixes because uh, it doesn't increase you to your damage so basically your damage is calculated separately from the minion damage The screen shake is real in this area. Okay. Let's not stand in the fire. I don't know about the skellies, but... One is already dead. Okay, let's move to the side quest. And the side quest will teach us something about the forge, I think. Yeah. Okay, let's... Uh, let's see if there's any good items here. Minion physical damage, necrotic damage, it's also good. This is a really good one that we have. Nothing really important apparently. This is also good because uh, we deal uh, a lot more damage. Okay, that's nice. Let's put a point here. Now we should, uh, whenever we splatter, we should put a debuff. I think. On the monsters. Right? Say it that way, right? Blood Flatter grants a million, yeah. I think the one that are splattered, so basically just the the melee ones. let's move because it was a little bit too uh, dangerous leader
Okay, so we finish the side quests. Okay, so we are level 16. We got uh, volatile zombies, but we won't use them. Let's see, should we increase our health or minion health or uh, let's increase the regeneration. After this, I will put just uh, I will put skill in this because platter will not. Uh, basically reach the skellies with the R, uh, with the bows and it will be a waste stay back run okay. this is a really nice looking boss Let's move from that beam because I think it will basically wreck us. Our golem is dead. We don't have any more mana. so he is dead so he dropped nothing of value for me okay so we need to go into the rift come on <laughs> are at the end of time you seem a little decisive he might be kind enough to show you how to here we can gamble uh, for some items but uh, i don't think it's necessary right now you've woke i okay so we unlock the mastery, we'll go on... Uh, we'll go as I said, we'll go with... Uh, choosing mastery class is final, okay. We'll go with necromancer. Uh, the thing is that uh, we will switch and use uh, summon raids. Because the raids does a lot of damage. So... For the skills, I think we will put a point into necromancy because we need level five to start summoning uh, skeleton mages. Um, I think we have one point to spend, so let's use it in uh, this at least to to get here. We don't need this. I don't think so. So another thing we will despecialize this and pick uh, where is it? 
very quick summon rates. It will start from level 3. Uh, what can we do? We can um, use the rays to be summoned at the target location. Or... I don't think uh, the health matters. Maybe we can increase their uh, necrotic uh, damage and... Rates have more maximum health. Rates no longer decay but you are limited only to two rates. Okay, can we increase the number? Yeah, you can increase the numbers of the summon rates. Hmm. So we can go with rates. Okay, for the moment, let's uh, put uh, two points here. And here for more mana efficiency. Let's get down. Done with gas. <laughs> Don't dwell too much on it. Do we need to speak again with... Okay, so... We have to speak again with him. I don't know exactly why I went uh, down. This minimap is a little bit confusing, to be honest. I see that you... Yeah, yeah. That okay. will be necessary if our world... Uh... I don't think we need minion health at this point. I think we need more damage. So we should put eight points here. Maybe we can do switch all minions. So let's... Uh, yeah, it's okay. Let's remove the archers and uh, increase the damage for the... I think we can add skeleton rogues. Does this increase the damage for the poison? What increase for the rogues? Mm, let me check. So this increase rogue damage. Okay, so... Yeah, I think we will go with rogues. Rogue damage. Okay, that's really good. Yeah. Okay, so... We are back. We have two side quests. That we need to finish. Okay. Stay May a terror smile upon you. Farewell. Greetings. Do not dwell on regret. Did we get something? Nope. Okay, we have a lot of stuff that we can sell. So because right now we are really minion focus, we should get uh, minion damage. Let's sell everything because we don't need it. I think we can also sell this. Let's search again. Nothing, okay. Let's proceed forward. Okay, so I think on uh, level 20 I will uh, put the golem here or perhaps the skeleton mages. Yeah, I think I'll put the skeleton mages for more damage. Okay. 
we can have uh, five uh, skellies right now because my mastery increases the mass skeleton mass skeleton mage and uh, my minions deal 50% uh, increased damage so right now our minion deals a lot more damage and as you can see we can summon raids but it's so it costs so much mana but our damage is so high right now with the minions Maybe we can do a necrotic build Maybe we will get something like uh, mana regeneration But uh, as you see right now my minions is basically bashing everything what I need is to sit back a little bit and command them. I have uh, my key on F to command the minions to kill everything. Okay, so the next uh, side quest is uh, ages ago, ages like distance. We are level 17. Let's put another point to increase our minion damage and uh, minion attack speed. Okay, so we are uh, entering uh, the surface. So basically we are leaving the underground.
Okay, so let's put another two points here. I think mana efficiency is way better than uh, summon fire rate. Can summon them so fast right now. So there's a mage here, we can kill. So he stunned my rate. This is down. Let's move the other way. I think this one's a little bit better. Doesn't uh, increase uh, the minion life that much, but it increases uh, our defensive capaci cap capacity way more than the other one.
Okay, so you can die until the game loads. Okay, something really interesting is happening. Okay, so we arrived in the camp. We can complete two quests. Let's check the vendor. It eludes me. It eludes me. Because we are in a town near um, a travel point, I think this is a good place to save. We will continue our adventures into the next episode. So I hope you enjoyed this one. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Have a great day. Bye.